Now we're going to start with KSHB 41 News reporter Megan Abundis, who is live outside of Union Station. Megan, I bet it's beautiful. Yeah. Hi, yes, NFL Draft Week is here. It's written on the newspaper. Hey, thousands of people out of KCI got this free travel guide as a warm Midwest welcome. Now the excitement is building and Kansas City is ready to take that big stage. Kansas City travelers are welcomed in with the new. Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, much better than the old one. And out through the doors. I can definitely feel all of the excitement around the city. Everyone's kind of buzzing. All the signs are up. This is all still new. I can't believe it's even happened. So the past five years have been surreal. It shows the city's culture. When you love a place, you want to share it with other people. So they'll share the biggest. Big, big mm -hmm. stage. Kansas City has ever seen. I think it is going to be a madhouse up there. I also think about the, all the legends that are going to be there, you know, all the announcers and all the all the fun stuff that's going to be there. Between Bryce and CJ Stroud being the number one or number two picks, that one change, that one strategy, that 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 that, that next pick could be, you know, the, the, the difference between a ring and not. I think let's get my home some weapons. A selection starting here could be a key to a season setup. From a strategy standpoint, whether it's a quarterback or a linebacker or a running back, um, that could be that missing gap that that one team needs. And we've seen it time and time again, where a team that was, you know, 0 and 15 for years gets one great player. And that player didn't change everyone and make everyone fit, but it made them all inspired and got them excited and gave them something to drive towards. Or just a chance to get some really good barbecue. I'll probably watch it, yeah. I mean, I doubt they'll be calling my name, but uh, you know. I'll, <laughs> I'll still be listening. I hope that they're welcome to the city, they get some great food, and they come back and see us again and spend some more money. Megan Abundis, KSHB 41 News.